islands to the north and east of the site at Simon's Court and Marina Court, and converted properties south of the site. There is an inch of flatter developments and single residential properties running along the length of South Parade. The earlier application for ten apartments was refused for one reason, that being an unnamely form of development by virtue of its relationship with the joint properties and its impact on amenities of the occupiers of those properties. At the subsequent appeal, at the, subsequent appeal the inspector considered there to be two main issues. The effect of the proposal on the amenities of occupiers of adjoining properties and the effect of the development on the character and appearance of the area. In respect of the character and appearance of the area, this did not form part of the Council's earlier reason for refusal, and the appeal inspector concluded that the scheme did not harm the character and appearance of the area and was of a scale and appearance that relates well to existing densities and form of development in the locality and would not result in a detrimental change in the character of the area. The inspector concluded that issues relating to design, materials, landscaping, parking, and the principle of the development were all acceptable. She also concluded that development would not adversely impact on the amenities of the occupiers of 7 to 3 Simon Court, so that's uh, this block here, at 7 to 13 Simon, uh, to the north, Marine Court to the east, so that's the, this group of properties, and then 53 South Parade, which is this property. Therefore, the sole issue remained the impact of the development on 1 to 6 Simon Court, which the inspector considered would have daylight and sunlight to habitable rooms unacceptably affected. These current proposals have been supported by a thorough and comprehensive daylight and sunlight assessment, which has considered in some detail the potential impact of the development on neighbouring properties. The mass of the development has been considerably reduced, with the building footprint being reduced on all levels that previously proposed, but with significant reductions being achieved on the second and third floors. This has resulted in the number of units being reduced from 10 to 8. The revised proposals comply with every measurable target set out in the British Research Establishment Guidelines, site layout planning for daylight and sunlight. And as a result of the reduced footprint and overall mass in the department, the scheme now proposed will not impact on the residents of 1 to 6 Simon Court. 
quite satisfied with the detail that's been provided with the application. So it is true that um, cycle parking can be out of this, um, but we're not satisfied with the detail at this stage, so the condition is there to require for the detail to be submitted. Sorry, just one, just one question from the other What was the level of the decision in 2015? Was it committee or was it? No, the committee reviewed the Okay, So the committee at that point had the opportunity to include um, the dining mail and the church on top of set off the boundary with 29 Oxford Drive by 300 kilometres, so it would only project an additional 1.1 metres um, from the conservatory extension at 29 Oxford Drive. And so if I just zoom in on this. So you can see the outline here of the extension that's been built. height is proposed to be raised at this point here um, and the chimney will be removed. So the extension at its ridge height would be 5.1 metres for the slope with, with, a, with a roof sloping away from the adjoining occupier um, and the distance from the, the ridge to the adjoining boundary um, is in excess of 4 metres. Given this, together with the conservatory extension at 29 Oxford Drive, Proposals would not impact on the adjoining property in terms of any loss of light or overlay impact. 
The additional footprint is less than 50% of that of the original dwelling, ensuring that the development of course is relevant local and national um, uh, policies. The development is considered to be accepted on its residents for approval, and there is a one-way petition for protection. Leave petition on to come Thank you. 